Well, a well-known Knoxville singer shot the day before Thanksgiving, nearly two years ago now, is continuing to make an impact. We're talking about Alonzo Rogers, a man whose murder has still not been solved. Last year, his final recorded song was released, and as WAT's Kristen Gallant reports, today we're learning more about the physical legacy he has now left behind. Alonzo Rogers had a powerful voice and, according to his friends, a heart of gold. Rogers was shot and killed in Knoxville the day before Thanksgiving in 2021, a tragedy that provided a gift of life for a woman hundreds of miles away. I had um, kidney failure. Uh, it's been approximately eight years now. Um, and then uh, I was on dialysis for... Um, seven years. Teresa Slosher lives in Ohio and had been waiting for a kidney donor. She's an O blood type and has high antibodies, which makes it hard to find a match. It was very scary for me. Um, I didn't know if I would get one or not. That is until one day she got a call from an unrecognizable number. On 11 28 21, I was shopping and um, it was right after Thanksgiving. And I received a call in the grocery store. <laughs> she almost didn't answer the phone, but something told her to pick up. Just told me it was a young person that had a tragic accident. And amazingly enough, you match up pretty good. And I was like number one on the list. It was Alonzo's kidney, but she didn't know it at the time. It would be three months later until she was able to write the family of the donor. And when she did, Alonzo's mom wrote back. She's called me. We've talked on the phone. The two were able to share their stories and Teresa was able to learn about Alonzo's powerful voice. I found him on YouTube and I can't tell you, <laughs> that was such a wonderful feeling, being able to watch my donor. She says listening to his music makes her feel closer to the man who helped save her life. He's my hero. He's, he's my angel. In Knoxville, Kristen Gallant, WATE 6 on your side. Kristen, thank you. Uh, Slosher has a picture, we understand, of Alonzo and the letter his mother wrote framed in her home. She also told us the hospital where she received Alonzo's kidney does a pinwheel memorial every year for all the organ donors, and she goes every year to honor his life-saving contribution. Mm.